What's up with y'all, man? It's just a chill room right here. I just want to talk a little bit about just what's going on, you know, um, difference between the left, the right, you know, and especially what's been going on with Antifa BLM and then the Trump supporters, as they say, you know, you got a lot of people saying that, you know, what the Trump supporters did um, is as equal as the Antifa, you know, it's Antifa, BLM, things like that, you know, if... BLM and Antifa was targeting strictly, let's say, the government. You know, let's say they gripe with the police department, you know. So they go out there, you know, and they specifically target, you know, uh, those functions, you know. I would be a little bit more understanding, you know. I would say, well, you know, at least, you know, they're not, you know, um, attacking innocent Americans or attacking innocents. You know, at least, you know, their their anger and their frustration is focused on in their eyes, their problem, right? You know, uh, but they did, you know, with Antifa BLM, you know, they went out there, they were looting, you know, they were flipping police cars, fighting police in the street, they were beating up, um, you know, Trump supporters, things like that, you know, burning things, you know, just vandalizing, just, just, just going crazy, right? You know, versus the Trump supporters, you know, their distaste, you know, their displeasure was with the government. So, they went out there and they 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 rushed the government building. You know, there was no looting. There was no burning. You know, it was none of that, you know. And it's funny how the left is always that side that, that plays race, man. They always bring up race, you know. Like, if you listen to both sides talk, right, you know, the left calls the right. They say, you know, they're white supremacists, you know, da, 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 da. But if you listen to, you know, both of their sides, man, you will see that the left is constantly bringing up race, constantly bringing up race. You know, everything that happened is it, it, it's always race, you know, and I feel like, you know, the left has been pushing this agenda, you know, for a while. You know, do I believe that BLM and Antifa uh, are funded by, uh, you know, kind of big league politicians, especially Democrats? Yes, I do. You know, you had the FBI come out and the FBI was like, you know, Antifa is not an organization. BLM is not an organization. They're ideas, you know, and that's crazy. You know, that's crazy. You know, you got the FBI sitting here making excuses for them, defending them. Meanwhile, any times any right wing supporter does anything, they're either called a white supremacist, they call a domestic terrorist, they call a fascist, you know, they call all these things. But when the left do the same things, you know, they're looked at as heroes. You know, that's crazy. A lot of people say, you know, well, what about free speech? You know, free speech does not exist when one group of people can get away with something that the other group cannot period you know you had BLM and Antifa go and establish an autonomous zone in Seattle you know they shut down the city and after they finished burning looting and, and, and vandalizing the city they went and occupied city blocks created their autonomous zone denounced their citizenship and none of the members were raided after it was took down and actually it was broken down pretty peacefully there was no bloodshed you know you look at a lot of the uh, the protests all last year, you know, it was massive uh, of chaos and violence um, being projected by the left. And there wasn't bodies all in the street. You know, and it's crazy how the left now is trying to sit here and act like they love this country. They're trying to sit here and say, oh, domestic terrorists, you know, how did they do this to our capital? But just a couple of months ago, the left was walking down the street chanting death to America, death to America, death to America. You know, and it's crazy. It's like you can't have it both ways. But we know that the left, they are the smiling fox and they are amazing at manipulating, amazing at manipulating. The media is on their side, social media, Instagram, all on their side. We can't argue that the left try to sit here, and act like they're the resistance. But the left is not the resistance. If anything, the right is the resistance because the government favors the left. The media favors the left. Everybody is against the right. Everybody, you know. And we just have to realize that this country has been infiltrated by the Marxists and the socialists. It's been infiltrated by the un-American, you know. It's funny how the, the left is trying to spin this, you know, America united front, you know, uh, now that they think that they won, now that their candidate is in office. But, you know, this whole last year, man, you know, I talked to so many people who lost their businesses, man. You know, people who got beat up in the streets. And I went out to a lot of these protests. I see in my own eyes. They'll try to sit here and say, oh, well, 
90 percent of the protest was peaceful you know like get that shit out of here bro 90 percent of those fucking protests were people i'm talking hundreds of people loot and vandalize hundreds of people out there man just just going crazy was there some that showed up that that truly uh, uh wanted peace yes there were but you're still attached to a violent movement you can't sit here and say that okay l- let me say let's say i agree with you right BLM and Antifa are not groups, right? Let's say they're ideas. They're still violent ideas. They're still violent ideas of violence. All they ever done was commit violence or spoke out against America. You know, that's not my flag. But now y'all talking about, you know, that's y'all flag. Now y'all talking about y'all support the flag because of right uh, went and stormed the government building. You know, you got to pick it, you know, pick your narrative. What is it? One minute is death to America, you know. That flag is not my flag. That flag is a symbol of racism. Then the next minute, it's oh my God, how they do that to our to to America? How they do that to 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 like it's crazy, you know? It's crazy how they try to spin it. And manipulation is a weapon. Propaganda is a weapon, and we have to be uh, willing to become outlaws. We have to. We have to be willing within a, a flip of a dime to become outlaws because the law abiding will be looked at uh, as traitors, you know, because think about it, we will be traitors to a tyrannical or a